On this episode of Epic Idaho, we're in South Central Idaho where we explore a hidden lagoon, zip beside the Snake River, and paddle into the maw of a waterfall. We are now at the base of Shoshone Falls, which is taller than Niagara Falls. I'm Chad Case. And I'm Jonathan Conti, and this is Epic Idaho. Idaho is, in a word, epic. And we should know, we travel the globe capturing adventure, but some of our favorite places are found right here at home in Idaho. Join us as we experience epic Idaho, from the stunning to the serene and everything in between. But first, a more relaxed expedition. We're gonna stop on the Snake River, grab a couple of kayaks and hit the water. All right, so we're starting our long journey down to Blue Heart Springs. It's a hot day, so we bring plenty of water. Got some backup sunblock. And I got a little snack in my box here. So we made it to Blue Heart Springs, right along the Snake River. Uh, why is it called Blue Heart Springs, you ask? Well, because of its shape. It's shaped like a heart, and because the water is blue, as you can see. So, on a hot day like today, it's a great place to swim. You can scuba dive, you can fish, it's also fed by these really cool underwater sand geysers that you can uh, swim around and check out. But yeah, Blue Heart Springs. That was more of a belly slam than, was a, it? <laughs> than a dive. Well, that's my thing. So um, right now we're in downtown Buell. At your downtown Buell. Yep. Downtown Buell at your ice cream shop. Where's your farm? Four miles south of here. And your ice cream is made from those cows yes. here. The milk comes from our cows. We bring the, the raw product in and make yogurt, butter, uh, ice cream. It's local. It is. Local's good. It is local. I am going to place this farm to table ice cream from Buell, Idaho into my soul. That's delicious. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna need a bigger harness. We are in the depths of the Snake River Canyon, getting ready to hop on the zip line here with AWOL zip line tours and we are stoked to get in the line. AWOL Zipline Tours has four unique lines inside the Snake River Canyon. The final one is 1,750 feet. That's 200 feet longer than the Perrine Bridge. Okay, Maya, we just finished zipping the snake. That we did, how was it? It was awesome. Good. How fast do you get going on that last line? It felt like it was going really fast. Oh, you can get anywhere from 30 to 60 miles an hour. And how about uh, if I want to bring my grandma up here? Oh yeah, we've had 86 year olds come on here, checking off their bucket list. So, did you move out to Twin Falls for the bridge? Yep, completely for the bridge. So what makes this bridge special? Obviously this is kind of like base jumper mecca, right? It's a mecca here because it's open 365 days a year. It's the only legal object that we have. This, you, could, you, you don't have to do anything. You just go out there and jump. So this is Pillar Falls, named after the pillars behind me and the falls all around me. This is a great day trip. You can just come out here, spend a little time in these falls. I see people fishing, having picnics, swimming. If you want to stop your journey here, trust me, that's all good. We are just suckers for pain, so we're going to continue on the next two miles to Shoshone Falls. Now, you can only do this late in the season. If this is early in the spring, the water is too high. I would be submerged right now, and you can't get past this point. But because the water is low right now, we're able to portage out and carry our boards over the falls to continue our journey. This is an awesome trip to make with a paddleboard, but if you're coming with a family, you might want to consider kayaks. You can put food and water in them, 
and they're a little bit easier to get up the canyon than a paddleboard. Um, you can also kneel on a paddleboard and uh, use my patent method of the SUP, which is a sit upon paddleboard, if you need some extra stability down low. Well, that about wraps her up for South Central Idaho. We gotta taste some nice farm to table ice cream, go paddle out in Blue Heart Springs where that beautiful clear water was bubbling out from the earth. And my personal favorite today is the Show Show and Falls shower. And it is hot. It's and toasty. on a hot day, that Show Show and Falls shower is just the cooling refreshment you need. And at first, I was not a fan of the SUP board. did not like the SUP board. But that was incredible. Yeah. That was a highlight of my Idaho adventures, right. for sure. Yeah. Everybody should go to Shoshone Falls. And if you want to plan your own Idaho adventure, go to www.visitidaho.org. Make sure you click on the links below and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss another episode of Epic Idaho. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Toasty. Mmm. Mm-hmm.